This episode of What's the Apps is brought to you by Carbonite. Well, hello there. What's going on? What's going down? Yeah? Oh, awesome. That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's John Q here from Techno Buffalo, and welcome to What's the Apps. I spent the last couple of episodes talking about iOS-based stuff, you know, iPhone, iPad, kind of thing. So I think it's fair to jump back onto Android. So for this episode of WTA, acronym right there, I'm going to be talking about my favorite Android application, Launcher Pro. And yeah, I, I, favoritist isn't a word. I know, I know that favoritist is not a word. To me, Launcher Pro embodies what Android is all about. It's a slick and lightweight application that's designed and developed to customize and maximize the user experience. And oh man, that sounded really cool right there. But I think I kind of ruined it by you know, saying all the stuff that followed up after that. But that's fine. We can pretend it never happened. Yes? All right, let's pretend, pretend's good, pretend. Launcher Pro serves as a home screen alternative. I had the HTC Incredible S for a little bit, so I got to experience SenseUI firsthand. The design of SenseUI, gorgeous, beautiful, amazing, but it, it was just really, really laggy, at least in my opinion. I loaded up Launcher Pro and it fixed it right away. And that's something I really recommend you guys do as well if you experience lag on SenseUI. I totally show you everything on screen, but I sold the phone about two weeks ago, so we're just gonna have to play pretend for a little bit. Besides dramatically improving performance, the amount of customization you can do with Launcher Pro is astonishing. First of all, unlike SenseUI, you can have up to five icons in the dock. If that wasn't enough, you can have more docks. Up to three, giving you a total of 15 icons. You can also customize the number of home screens, home screen transitions, number of columns, show the count of unread messages, customize the dock skin, hide the notification bar, hide icon labels, hide applications you don't like, change the size of on-screen widgets, very handy. All of these fun-filled advanced options do this really, really cool trick, a bunch of other stuff, and oh yes, use the thing in fudging landscape mode, oh yes. Personally, I prefer a really, really basic setup. Three home screens, one dock, and a reduced app list. I cannot tell you how handy that was on the HTC Incredible S, as it had tons of Bell bloatware on it, like Bell TV or some sort of weird golf game. And again, we gotta pretend here. Launcher Pro comes with its own set of widgets. But this is Android here. A lot of people, including myself, are fans of that oh-so-fabulous Sense UI clock. Unfortunately, the default application doesn't have it. But you can pick up an add-on called L. LP Sense Skin plus Clock Widget at the market for a pretty okay price, and it works flawlessly. That's what I'm talking about. You can also back up all of your settings onto your memory card, you know, just in case something happens. Speaking of just in case something happens, not so smooth transition right there, but, but that's okay. I want to take some time to give a shout out to Carbonite. Computer disasters happen eventually to everyone. Your computer crashes, it gets infected with a virus, you drop it, theft, fire, etc. But if you get Carbonite online backup before your disaster happens, then no need to worry, my friends, because all of your files will be backed up automatically and safely off-site, and it's really easy to get them back. Plus, you get anytime, anywhere access to your backed up files from any computer or even on your smartphone or iPad with the free Carbonite app. Cool! With Carbonite, unlimited backup from your Mac or PC is just $59 a year. That's less than $5 a month. Wow! <laughs> but when you use the offer code TECHNO, that's T-E-C-H-N-O, to start your free 15-day trial, you'll get two months free if you decide to buy. All of the details can be found at Carbonite.com, and remember to use the offer code TECHNO, that's T-E-C-H-N-O, to get two months free with purchase. I've never experienced any issues with Launcher Pro, if anything, since UI gave me more of a headache than Launcher Pro. Best of all, this thing is free. Yes, it is free indeed. There is a paid version which gives you extra Sense UI widgets, highly recommended, but not necessary. So for that reason and all of the wonderful stuff I mentioned, Launcher Pro, 5 out of 5. If you don't have this on your Android phone, then you are seriously missing out. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my review of Launcher Pro and seriously check out this application. It's really, really that good. And after everything I said, if you still don't want to check out Launcher Pro for some unknown reason, then we we don't got anything left to talk about, man. That's for true right there. Like that. I didn't snap properly. There we go. Like that. <laughs> Just cut in. This was John Q from Techno Buffalo. Thank you very much for checking out my review. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.